It's me again, YouTube. This is with, uh, I guess, a new deck profile for my deck. Uh, Black Wings, as usual. I made a few new changes, which I actually like a lot. Um, I was able to get some values, so they definitely helped out a lot, too. Um, so, yeah, let's get right to the deck, then. Three Sirocco, you know, beat stick can't. It's the basic big beater cyber dragon of the deck. Pump up things to attack over other things. Kind of avoids gores if you're attacking into something with like boar or something like that. So that's always a good plus. So uh, I like three. I don't really like using just two because I always end up needing them some in some way, shape, or form. So three usually is a good number. Three Shira. Um, it's Shira. You know, you know what it does. Don't really need to explain how much it else. Three Bora, Piercer, still, you know, decently high attack power, special summons, no, another black wing, whatever. Kalut, triple, honest, you have to run three. Running any less than that is just kind of stupid since he's not limited or anything, so. Um, two Blizzard. I was running three at one point, but that was before I got my second Bayou. So, I went back down to two, and it's working out a little bit better, so, yeah. I don't like three much anymore with the car other cards I have in here now. Two value. I guess I was kind of hasty in obtaining these, even though it's coming out as a super in the tin new tins. But, I prefer the ulti and ultras one. I want to get another ulti one, but I think, you know, it's whatever, so... I like running two. Three is a bit much, and one just isn't enough. Two DD Crows, main. That's right, I main them. I don't see in Black Wings you kind of you can you can get away with maining them. I don't see why you wouldn't, since it is a wing beast. It's dark can be Lord Icarus attack. You know, blah blah blah. So yeah, one Gale. It's Gale. You can't really, uh, you know, it's Gale. You can't go wrong with that. Dad, one dad. Some people aren't running dad for some reason. I find that even I can still control my graveyard somewhat with Blizzard and Bayou, so dad is almost never a dead draw for me. Late game, sure, maybe, but normally that's I've already won by then, so you know. Three Book of Moon. I was running two, but uh, I put in a third over another cards for Black Feathers because mainly it protects your monsters as well as helps Shura get out other things. You know, book something, get Shura out. Also helps with Vayu too because if you book the Synchro that Vayu brought out, it gets its effect when you flip it back up. So that's, I guess, a, you know, pretty much a must in this type of build. Two Whirlwind, Rhoda. It's a staple. Can't you can't really play Black Wings in this type of format without Whirlwind. So one allure and one cards. I was running two, but I found it always clogged up my hand if I if I ever drew both of them at the same time. So I went down to one and one, and it's working out pretty good so far. So uh, one brain control, storm, MST, all staples. You know what they do. If you don't, you should probably not play this game anymore. Two Icarus. Yeah, there's a gold. I want to get one more gold, but you know, because I think I have one sided, but I find three is a little bit too much. Uh, sometimes I usually side in the third just in case if I'm in a, depends on the matchup, but two seems pretty basic for me, you know, no, no real problems with two, so. Two Dust Tornado. Some people don't like main in these anymore. I do. Uh, just get rid of a lot of back rows because if you're going to be special summoning a lot and want to push for game, then you need to clear that back row. So. Double Oppression. Um, yeah, it's a somewhat staple now in Black Wings since, it's, since Black Wings aren't uh, top tier anymore. It's kind of like the anti-meta card in the deck now, since the deck can run without special summoning that much. Plus, Vayu and Blizzard can get around it. Blizzard only if Whirlwind's on the field, but Vayu can definitely get around it. 
um, bottomless staple solemn and starlight pretty much staples uh, I guess we'll go to the side deck now uh, two cyber dragons uh, Still, for those random Machina decks out there, you know, you can't really go too wrong with that. Especially since kind of Fortress, and you can just, hey, scoop up and get a Chimeric Deck Fortress out without, you know, worrying it too much. Um, one Breeze. I'm looking for, I'm not sure what I can take him out for in my side deck. I just kind of sided him for now, because I don't really have room for him in the main deck, so. Um, one Gores. Oh, stops with TKs, you know. One Vortex. Uh, one My Body. One Delta Crow. I was thinking about mating it, but I don't really have room for it. So for now, it's sighted. Uh, the last Icarus I want to make out of gold. But, you know. One Mind Crush. Two Threatening. Uh, two crevice into the different dimension and two skill drain. Uh, you know, basic side deck. It helps. It stops uh, X Sabers and as well as uh, Infernities and you know whatnot. I took out the wild tornadoes because they weren't working as well as I hoped they would. Because even when they do homely, they always have that stupid Gotham's emergency call. Which I'm looking for at least two of those. So if you had any, look through my binder video and I'll definitely trade uh, for them. So uh, let's go to the extra deck. Catister, you know. Magical Android. Brianak. Two armed wings, gold. One Black Rose, two Armor Masters, one Stardust, one Silver Wind, one Red Dragon, one Colossal, uh, one Infernity Doom Dragon. Um, he is my helper just in case, like Consecrated comes out, I can basically book it. Book the Consecrated, blow it up, you know, something like that, stuff like that. Or if, you know, if I attack into it and it's a Consecrated, hey, I have him, I can use it out for that. Uh, Blackwing Dragon. I don't know why. I just kind of like him just because he's there. And you know, he can help, help stop the stupid Frog OTK, so. Since he can gain as many counters as he wants and, you know, whatever, so. And last, Chimeratic Fortress Dragon. I'm thinking. I think I want to put the Thought Ruler back in, but I'm not sure what I want to take out. I want to keep the Blackwing Dragon in, but everything else seems like uh, I kind of need it. So if you have any suggestions, I guess comment or whatever on that. Um. So yeah, that's pretty much the deck and whatever. So if you comment, subscribe, you know, whatever. All right. See you later, YouTube.